we live in a very different world. Today's world treats victims very, very differently. Today's world does not allow some of the victim shaming that could have taken place at trial. Today's world understands that when interviewing victims, when eliciting testimony, that testimony can be sometimes contradictory. Today's world doesn't buy attempts to rewrite history either. But hey, that was a nice try, Alex. Welcome to the Iron Troll Channel, hosted by internet fashion icon and social media influencer, Zeely Ohai. And now, here's Zeely. Alex Acosta has resigned his cabinet post. He makes the 13th member of Trump's cabinet to resign or be fired in what is obviously the most corrupt and scandal-ridden administration in the history of America. Acosta resigned over the Jeffrey Epstein pedophile scandal. He broke the law by giving Epstein an incredibly generous and very secret plea deal without notifying Epstein's victims. In a recent press conference, Acosta attempted to whitewash his actions. So, um, first, let me, let me point out, we followed department policy. So, um, I don't think we can say you know, take a case that is this old and fully know how it would play out today. Now we all understand that way, 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 way back in the ancient days of 2008, times were different. Way back in 2008, rich white pedophiles had more rights than underage girls. I'm here to say we did what we did because we wanted to see Epstein go to jail. He needed to go to jail jail. He needed to go to jail. And that was, that was the focus. They wanted a conviction that included jail time, restitution, and registration as a sex offender. What good is sex offender registration when it's public information that Epstein used his employees to procure his victims? So the victims should come forward because the justice system needs to hear from them. And what the victims went through is horrific. What the victims continue to go through is horrific. And, and, and so it's hard. And so this is horrific. This is awful. Um, each one of these cases is just devastating and saddening. Um, so um, he's a, you know, he's a bad man. Fortunately, the whole world is now watching the Jeffrey Epstein case. More victims have come forward. He could end up in prison for the rest of his life. This time, he won't be on a work release program. And that's it for this episode of Iron Troll. Thanks for watching, and if you haven't already, please click on the subscribe button below.